What a great question, does art matter? It matters to me, and that is, I think, the essential thing. On the uh, 17th of April last year, I had a quintuple bypass. Three months later, with nothing else to do, I started to paint. Well, I'm throwing myself into this with such vigour that it is in fact at times worrying the people around me because I'm meant to be taking it easy. However, the one thing that stresses the hell out of me, and that's my main problem, is the business that I'm involved in, which is, of course, the Spades Coast to Coast. So what I've done is I've hived all that off. Now I can concentrate on the thing that I'm really, really involved in, which is the painting. And of course, I've got another book that I'm halfway through writing as well. I'm going to take you on a little trip through the, um, through the gallery. Bear in mind, this is the first time that I've actually ever had an exhibition in my life. This work is entitled Broken on the Wheel of Love. And again, it's a sign motif that I've used throughout the exhibition and you've got what I think has happened to New Zealand in the last 15 years. We've gone from uh, a, 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 to a rigidly, politically correct, ultra-conservative society, which to my mind is broken on the wheel of love. And I was fascinated by um, this section in here, which is like a woman's stiletto, and I fantasized that it was in fact the, the stiletto worn by a transvestite dancer in an all-male go-go review in Sydney, and this was his stiletto-heeled shoe. Um, what I'm drawing here, or painting here, is a, a political placard that's been um, bolted to a fence prior to the election. This is the first cartoon, this is the second cartoon. This features Helen Clark. That, this one here features a, a character called Tamahiri McLeary. Well, no idea what this is going to be, but with a name like Decadence, it could be about anything, couldn't it? Could be a political statement. Could be about New Zealand first. I want it to go. 